Hello viewers, welcome back. Today we will study the third standard maths chapter number 3 addition. Okay, so I cannot able to explain all the exercises in one video. So I will make a different videos for different exercises. So in this video we will learn till exercise 3.1. Okay, okay fine. So here one game of addition is there starting. See, a girl named Pinky is, here is a girl named Pinky. This is her landlord house. It is so big that it has 100 rooms and some rooms have to be painted. Okay. Now, from room number 4. Room number 5 is already painted and next room to be painted is room number 15. So, she wanted to go from 5 to 15. So, there are two ways to reach the room. One is from 5 we need to count till 15. So, from 5 if we count till 15 there are 10 numbers. So, 5 plus 10 is equal to 15. Second thing is we can jump. 10 times forward to reach 15th room. So, 5 plus 10 is equal to 15. See here, think to go to room 45 from room 15, I have to jump up dash times. To go from 15 to 45, how much times Pinky want to jump? Okay. See, 15 to 25, 10 times. 25 to 35, 10 times. So, 10 plus 10, 20. From again 35 to 45, again 10 times. So, 30 times. How many times? 30 times. Here we will write 30. In the same way, to go to room number 66 from room 45, jump 2 times, then move forward right side and reach 66. See, from 45 to 55, 10 times 55 to 65 20 times and if we want to go to 66 another one time we need to move so how many times we have moved we have moved 21 times okay okay again from room number 45 to 46 we can jump this is the second uh, second step from 45 to 46 we can move, then 46 to 56, 10 times, 56 to 66, another 10 times, so 21 times, okay. Like this we can cross think and we can think by our mentality that how can we do the addition, okay. There are lots of ways of doing addition, it is up to you, it is up to the children's ability that how do they will understand and which type they will follow to do the addition okay whichever is easiest for you you can do for you can do for their for your children okay so we will do here different different types of addition i will help you to do in different different ways whichever is easy for you you can help your children to uh, study like that okay now next let us try and get the answer 66 plus 10 76 okay Second one, 73 plus 25. First, let us count the ones place. 3 plus 5, 8. Okay, 7 plus 2, 9. So, 98 is the answer. Third one, add 9 to 29. First, we will count units place. 9 plus 9, 18. So, we will write 8 and 1 we will take to tens place. 2 plus 1. 3, 38. Fourth one, add 15 to 13. So, 5 plus 3, 8. 1 plus 1, 2. 28 is the answer. Add 30 plus 20. 30 plus 20 is 50. 30, 40, 50. Okay. Here, now word problems are there. See here, here some examples are given for the word problems. See example number one, Nitesh and Nirmala went to fruit shop along with their mothers. Nitesh, mother, I like pomegranate. Nirmala, I like watermelon. So, mother brought pomegranate for 49 rupees and watermelon for 42 rupees. Now, shopkeeper told immediately 
the amount paid to them. So, 49 plus 42, how should we calculate this? See, we can calculate like this, 49 plus 42. First, we will add one's place, 9 plus 2, 11, 1, carry. So, 4 plus 4, 8, 8 plus 1, 9. So, the sum is 91. Okay. We can try the other problems also. See here, 43 plus 35. Another one method is we can split the numbers and we can add. See, 40 plus 3, 30 plus 5. 40 plus 30 plus 3 plus 5. 40 plus 30, 70. 3 plus 5, 8. 78. Okay, second example is also done for you. I will do this one which is not done. Okay. 61 plus 16. 61 we will split as 60 plus 1. And 16 we will split as 10 plus 6. So, 60 plus 10, 1 plus 6. Okay. 60 plus 10 is 70. 1 plus 6 is 7. So, the answer is 77. Okay. 43 plus 34. 40 plus 3, 30 plus 4. So, we will add 10's place. 40 plus 3, 40 plus 30, sorry, 40 plus 30, 70. 3 plus 4, 7. So, the answer is 77. Okay. See here, children, one problem is there here. See, if you want to do any addition, the simplest form is first we will count the units place, then we will count the tens place, then hundred place. So, here let us count the units place first. 6 plus 6, 12. We will write 2 here and 1 we will take carry to the tens place. Now, we will add 1 plus 4, 5. 5 plus 4, 9. 9 here, 1. Okay. So, first if we want to add the thing, we will add from unit place, then tens, then hundred. Here one more example is there. See here. 4 plus 3. 4 plus 3. 7. 8 plus 2. 8. 2 plus 1. 3. So, the total number is 387. Okay. Next. Here one more answer we should find. 8 plus 3. If we will add 8 plus 3. After 8 let us count 3. 9. 10. 11. If we will get two digits by adding one's place, we have to write the digit which is there in one's place in the one's place and we have to take carry one to tens place. Okay, so we will write here one and we will take one carry here. One plus two, three. Three plus three, six. Okay, six. Three plus one, four. Four hundred and sixty-one is the answer. Okay, hmm. so exercise three point one is solve the following problems we need to solve the problems here okay see both ashok and nishchita have a rose garden each there are 266 roses in ashok garden 314 roses in nishchita's garden total how many roses are there so if we want to put the things together we will do the addition so we want to put uh, Ashok's roses and Nishchita's roses together. So, we will add. Okay. First, we will write roses in Ashok's garden is 266. Roses in Nishchita's garden is 314. So, let us count add these two roses. Okay. First, we will start counting from units place. 6 plus 4, 10. So, as I have told you, we will write 0 here and we will take 1 carry. 6 plus 1, 7. 7 plus 1, 8. 8. 3 plus 2, 5. The answer is 580. Total number of roses is 580. Second one. Observe the moving train. There are 106 passengers in coach 1. 130 passengers in coach 3. So, what is the total number of passengers traveling in 2 coaches? Passenger in coach c1 compartment 1 is 116 passenger in compartment 3 is 130 so the total number is 6 plus 0 6 
1 plus 3, 4. 1 plus 1, 2. 246. As I have told you, for, we should always count from unit place. Okay. Next question. A teacher has identified talented students in drawing and singing as follows. So, teacher have the list of the talented students in drawing and singing. We need to total them. Okay. Boys. How many boys are there? Singers, 112. Artist, 284. So, let us add 112 and 284. The answer is 396. Okay. Total is 396. Now, let us add the girls. Okay. 121 plus 248. The answer is 369. So, this is the first part of uh, lesson number 3, edition of grade 3. Uh, if you want more videos like this, uh, subscribe to my channel. I will post next video uh, in the, I will post the next edition part in the next video. Okay, thanks for watching.